water. Today, Mandabi, often credited as the first full-length film in colour made in West Africa by a local director, Mandabi, money order in the Wolof language, follows illiterate layabout Ibrahima, husband to two wives and father of seven children, on his impossible mission to cash a money order. The film was directed and written by Usman Samben, who also wrote the novel of the same name. It is a subtle social commentary garnished with dry comedy and generally belligerent side characters, hinging on the very believable and ultimately lovable Ibrahima, who is a bit like a Senegalese hybrid of Captain Mannering and Homer Simpson. <laughs> The story is very simple. Everywhere Ibrahima goes in order to wade through the bureaucracy of cashing a money order from his nephew in France, he bleeds money he does not have by being charitable, generous, and gullible. Meanwhile, his wives also struggle to resist purchasing the bare necessities. As with the story, the characters too can feel straightforward, but they're drawn and acted with a deft touch, and feel not at all like caricatures, but typically idiosyncratic people. Mandabi was made with a Senegalese audience in mind, not as an export. So to me, it's a window into a different time and culture, but the considered handling still allows the characters and humour to be very relatable. Although the theme of poverty and community are present throughout, Mandabi feels very gentle until its final moments, where the weight of Ibrahima's desperate task comes to bear. Tomorrow, offensive, disgusting, immature, hurtful, it's poison! Don't be violent.